Hey, okay. You know what I'm talking about? And we rocking like that. You know what I'm talking about? Motor Crest, Shawty, Texas Coach, Shawty, Sun Valley, Shawty, man. Bomb me a bushy girl. You know what I'm talking about? Rocking like that. Good off track and always from Texas Coach. Like right, that. you ain't no. If I catch me in it for a million bucks, that's why I feel I got beat with a million bucks. Grind 28 on my home or truck. It's a Walla Walla world. All right, it did. The game is over, man. Oh, man. The pain, the pain, man. Motherfucking Boston Celtics. Win game seven at home. Milwaukee loses, and now they will have to wait till next year to try to contend for another title. The champs have been dethroned by the Boston Celtics, man. Let me tell you something, man. These are my final thoughts on this game. Look, man, I'm not I'm totally disappointed in the Bucks on this one, man. Um they shot themselves out of the game. They couldn't buy a basket, shoot long range, unnecessary shots. Brook Lopez started out well, did not play big at all, couldn't find me anywhere underneath the boards to get rebounds. I mean, he just laid a fucking egg. And I don't know how the fuck Giannis missed like six goddamn finger rolls in a row. I mean, and a part of their defensive strategy was to let them shoot. They've been shooting the shit out of us for the past three games. You have to hold these guys consistently. Fuck the paint. They more sorry to paint to me than how they shoot because, I mean, Tatum been lights out, man. Then you let Grant Williams shoot the lights out? That's what I feared. Like, you got Pritchard coming off the bench. You got Williams coming off the bench. <laughs> shoot. I mean, everybody just killed him. Even Marcus Smart here and there hitting a big shot, man. Um, you know, everybody just coming off, just doing their thing, man. And I'm not going to even get into those atrocious ass calls by the referees because I hate to sound like I'm making some type of excuses because the main reason why we lost was because of the style of play. Nobody did nothing, man. We couldn't do nothing. We weren't effective on the inside, outside, or any of that. So, you know, at the end of the day, you know, we just, the, the, the better team won, man. The better team the better team won because we allowed them to shoot way too much. You know, I'm going to keep it 100% funky, man. Drew Holiday played like hot garbage. Brooke Lopez, hot garbage. Pat Connaughton, hot garbage. You know what I mean? That ain't no knock on them. But even Bobby couldn't come through for us in this game. They, nobody could buy a basket, man. But look, man, I'm tell you something. We need to... Find out ways to get certain players in here next year to, 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 to keep the hope alive. Let me tell you something, man. Uh, hate to say it, man. Wesley Matthews laid an egg defensively and offensively. You had, like, two good off defensive games. No good offensive games the whole playoffs. See you later. George Hill, see you later. Man, who else? <laughs> man, there's a couple of people. Brooke Lopez, we need to move that contract. Real talk, man. We need to see if we can get more effective players in there, man, and make sure that we surround Giannis around some winners that can keep the championship tradition going in Milwaukee. They pretty much made everybody look right that was going against the Milwaukee Bucks. That's my final thoughts. Next year, there's always next year. I'm out, man. Peace.